Good morning everybody and welcome back to Not That Kind of a Channel. My name is Peter and in today's video I will change my rock sliders on our Land Rover Discovery 4. Um, why I'm doing this, you will think, um, because um, with our Beef Goodrich on, um, the wheels are so rough um, that they threw stones and now the rock sliders always look like this. So <laughs> as you can see, they were rusty. Um, and I have to restore them every year and I don't want to do this anymore and in case of that I always change the tires um, I think you maybe saw this on my Instagram post so I'm going back to the 90 inch rims um, with some good Uranga on it I mean at the moment um, the car looks a bit strange um, because if you know the car from before um, yeah, <laughs> but I will do um, another paint here, which means um, these uh, rims get the color of the door handles here. So it, they will also get uh, painted. And another sad thing this week happens. Um, someone uh, used our Discovery 4 um, to stop this car. <laughs> uh, gratefully, no one was hurt. And yeah, and this will also be fixed um, for a workshop. Um, within the next two weeks. Now I will show you the new rock sliders. Um, I think they were well packed and I didn't unbox them until today because I want to do this with you. Um, now I will place the camera and then we will unbox them together. So now I did a little bit of unboxing, of more unboxing, <laughs> and I will show you how the uh, rock sliders look like from the top and from the bottom and what you will get with them. So let's change the view. Here you can see this is the top view. Um, I think they're really well made. It's the MP4 before logo. Yeah. And here on the back, this is the bottom view. You can see here um, there are a lot, there's a lot of metal on it and what also is cool is um, you get this package of bolts and screws with them and yeah now i will uninstall the old ones and get the new ones on and i will tell you what you have to do if you don't have uh, rock sliders installed and you have this plastic cover on so let's go and let's do the job That was a bit of rust. Um, if you don't have installed your rock sliders, uh, there is a plastic cover on. And this plastic cover you have to remove. And I think it's clipped in and you can get it off. And then um, you will see all these holes, which are uh, behind this rock slider here. <clears throat> A bit of rust, but not that much. Uh, we'll show you this here. Just wait a second. Um, but a lot of dirt. <laughs> so let's look here. Um, the most of this one is dirt, so it's okay. But uh, I have to do something here. So after dismantling uh, both of them, uh, I will get the car out and give it a jet wash under here. Just this one. Yeah, it has to. Get off. So 
So the next step I will do is I will mount the rock sliders for you um, so you can see how they will be mounted. And after that, uh, I will unmount them again and do the paint job, uh, which I really have to do because I don't want uh, that the rust get more. So that's what I'm going to do now. Uh, okay, so let's start. So um, there are two types of screws or bolts. Um, the round one with the round head, they're, uh, they are for the top here. And the other ones, they are for the bottom. So. I think they should really stay safe in place with this one. Okay, now I will try to get this one on. So what I'm gonna do now is I add some grease um, to the bolts so that they will came off again and then get them in. So, and this is how the rock sliders look like. It's the first one here. And I have to say, um, there is one really cool feature, which uh, I've never seen before on a, on a rock slider, and this is this one here. So this is a cover um, that dirt won't get in. I think this is really cool because the old one, they doesn't have this one, this cap on the back. So that's really great. So guys, I have mounted both of them. I've mounted both rock sliders and I think it turned out really well and it really looks good. The mounting was really easy. Um, and the quality, I think, is really good because, as I said before, um, there is one cap at the back so they can not uh, get any dirt in it, and this is really cool. Um, here is how the rock sliders look on the Discovery 4. Let's go over here. Let's check out this side. I think they're really nice, and they are really wide, so you can you can easily step on them and get easily into your car. So this is it from my side and how to mount the rock sliders on the Discovery 4. I have to say thank you to MP4x4 by half sponsoring me this video and half sponsoring uh, the rock sliders. Um, if you like the video, it would be really great if you give me some thumbs. And if you want to see more from that kind of content, it would be really great if you subscribe. Guys, have a nice day and see you soon. Bye.